our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Day 24. Pray for his priorities. But seek first his kingdom and his righteousness, and all these things will be given to you as well. Matthew chapter 6 verse 33. Lord, I pray for my husband's priorities. Help him to prioritize you first and foremost, and secondly, his family above all priorities. Help his priorities to align with your word. I trust and believe that if he seeks first your kingdom and righteousness, all other things will fall into place. Matthew chapter 6 verse 33. Amen. Daily generational prayer of blessing for you and your husband. May the Lord bless you and show himself real to you. May the Lord keep you and put a hedge of protection around you. May the Lord make his face shine on you and light your life with the fullness of his glorious character. May the Lord be gracious to you and show his saving power to you. May the Lord lift up his countenance on you and show how pleased he is with you. May the Lord give you his peace and bring you his wholeness. May you grow deeper in love with each passing day as you grow deeper in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ. May your marriage fulfill the purpose that God intended it to. May you walk out the call of God on your lives individually as a couple. May your children, finances, and your endeavors be blessed by God and bring Him glory and honor. May your marriage and home be a house of prayer, a house of worship, a house of joy, and a small heaven. This is my prayer for you and the generations to follow. In the strong and mighty name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, Amen.